happy Diwali Net IP. Uh, thank you so much for choosing Grameen Foundation for your philanthropy uh, dollars this year. Uh, my name is Mal Malini Tolat and I work with Grameen Foundation. I work with a group that's looking at supporting the poorest people in the world, people who don't even have access to regular microfinance services right now. And with these people, we find that one of the biggest challenges they face is the fact that their livelihoods are so erratic and so unreliable that they're not able to determine, you know, from day to day where they're going to get their next income or where they're going to get their next meal. Uh, and Grameen Foundation is working with a local organization to start a project in Bihar where we will be providing support to uh, these communities to help them engage in business opportunities and provide them with the resources that really can help them develop income streams that are more reliable and help them move out of poverty in a sustainable way. Uh, so, I mean, I was visiting the project site in Bihar just in October. There I met with this woman, Sham Sundari, who is in our project area. And Sham Sundari has a family of seven, five children. Uh, they uh, work, uh, you know, the husband and wife, their only source of income is through casual labor uh, on the fields. They don't know from day to day where their next job is coming from. Uh, they earn approximately about 18 cents a day and have a debt right now from the local money lender of over $200. Uh, so what our project is going to try and do is help Sh uh, Sham Sundari and her husband engage in activities, perhaps uh, help them buy a goat and uh, you know, help, uh, give them training on how to uh, manage the goat and where to sell the goat and get the best price for the goat or how to maybe get together with another group of people just like them and uh, rent a piece of land to grow some vegetables on so they can earn some income from selling those vegetables. These types of small projects that over a period of time can help them build more sustainable livelihoods. And by the time they've been with the project for about 18 months, we, we expect that Sham Sundari will actually have savings of about $25 uh, in her family and she'll be able to access the microfinance loans that are given from other microfinance organizations and get on to that pathway out of poverty. Many more women like Sham Sundari out there in the world and Grameen Foundation wants to make this kind of change happen for them on a, on a really scaled basis across the world and that's one of the reasons I'm there with Grameen Foundation working with them to try and see what I can contribute to this process. So I want to thank you for supporting us and I hope that uh, uh, this example, this has provided you with a concrete example of the kind of work Grameen Foundation is trying to do in India and in other parts of the world uh, and I'd like to request you to keep supporting us in our endeavors in doing this. I wish you a very, very happy Diwali and a wonderful festive season and I hope that NetIP and Grameen Foundation continue to collaborate going forward.